Welcome back to Banglewood Craft Supplies. Today what we're going to do is hand paint a nice little dome bangle. The supplies you're going to need are a paint pen, I like the Sharpie brand, a nice little paint brush, paint of course, um, I've got some green, some orange, and vanilla, any color that you're interested in would be awesome. Of course, as always, Mod Podge for sealant and uh, polyurethane for sealant. I actually really like polyurethane for hand painted bangles. Um, here's some examples of what I've done in the past. I was looking for a pink bangle and I said, hey, let me just make one. So I made this one and this one. Really fun craft project. Alright, so let's get started. Dab a little here, and I'm going to paint a nice little flower. So, start off, what would a flower look like? These are cute. I actually made some of these once, and they sold quickly. They were very small, slender bangles. So here's what I'm doing right now. Um, just making little, kind of like little trees. Just imagine that you're in the forest and you're looking at trees and you're making some. So, that's what I did with this side. So what I'm going to do now is go ahead and shake up some paint. Pop open the top. And if you don't want to just take it from the top, you can always pour some on the wax paper. And that's another thing you're going to need. Wax paper is the best thing for anything craft because it doesn't stick. So now what I'm doing is just putting a little dots. Making little flowers. Doop, doop, doop. This is really awesome. Um, I love polka dots. Can I do it upside down is the question. Yes, I can. So I'm making little flowers out of these. Just around the tree. We're going to do one tree. Let's finish one tree. Let's say some of the leaves fell. The bottom. Put it at the base. Okay. So, got some orange in there. Let's close her up. Well, no, let's keep her up. Now let's get some green. Okay. Some people don't like to do this. They like to keep their paint separate. I'm sloppy, so I just throw it all in. Now we're going to throw some green in here. Nice little autumn colors. Even though it's August, I guess I'm still in autumn. So see how it's coming to life? Got nice little green in here. The tree is getting some color. And I like how the orange is kind of in with the green and throw some on the ground. Let's save some of that. Awesome. So it's coming to life. Um, now I want some white. Now I'm really about to mess up everything. Then I'm going to throw some white just to make the colors pop a little bit more. A little white here. White there. White is always a good color to just bring a little bit more accent to your hand paint. So, this was my demonstration for the day. Um, so what I'm going to do is just continue to use the paint pen, go around the bangle with the structure of the little trees, and then just add my little paint to color and decorate the trees. Um, and once I let it dry, I'm going to do the, the insides, and it's always fun to do stuff on the insides as well. I might put a few trees on the inside just to make it cute. And once it dries, I'll seal it with Mod Podge and with polyurethane and again thank you for watching um again there's always other bangles that we have we have these 
Um, this is actually the size that I used last time, and they sold really nice. It was like a, a dozen, not a dozen. I did about three, and I just put little trees on them. So, here you go. Check out my Etsy page. Check out my website. Have a great one. Banglewood Craft Supplies.